convicted fraudster Obi Wanne Okeke, who is currently serving a 10 year jail term in the United States for wire fraud, says he finds it insulting to be compared with another Nigerian, Ramon Abbas, aka Oshpopi, facing similar charges in the US. Mr. Okeke, alias Invictus Obi, was under the sentence in February for computer-based intrusion fraud scheme that cost approximately $11 million in known losses to his U.S.-based victims. Speaking with a crime journalist, David Pright, in an interview held in August and published recently, OKK said he helped his community and should not be compared with Oshpopi. It is insulting. Me and Oshpopi are not the same level. Oshpopi could never achieve what I achieved. He cannot run a business and we are not similar in any way. He was out to please the crowd. I was out to change lives, create jobs and conquer the business world, he said. According to court documents, the 33-year-old OKK operated a group of companies known as Invictus Group based in Nigeria and elsewhere. Oshpopi had a penchant for flaunting wealth on social media. I have done so much for my community back home with my charity foundation. Which lives has he helped? Nobody. OKK had it. Asked if he disliked Oshpopi. He responded, No, I have never met him, but I just find the continued comparison very annoying. Our impact on the world is very different. I have made a much more positive contribution to society than he has. OKK was arrested in August 2019. Forbes had him listed as one of the influential young entrepreneurs. Okeke entered into a deal with the U.S. government by pleading guilty to the second charge of wire fraud, among others, to enable him to enjoy immunity from prosecution on the same matter in the U.S. Eastern District of Virginia. Mm -hmm.